Hello everyone. This is brief introduction about me. I got selected as income tax inspector in SSC CGL 2022. This is my scorecard. I got 87 by 90 in quant. In my previous video, I told you about option verification method and lot of people asked me to explain it in detail. So, I am uploading this video. I hope it helps you in your preparation. Let's get started. Look at the sum. Find the flooring cost of this path at the rate of 27.5 per square meter, which means the final answer should be a multiple of 27.5. We can write 27.5 as 11 into 2.5. So the final answer should be a multiple of 11. Just verify 11 multiple in the options and you will get the answer. Moving on to the next. We know that distance equal to speed into time. So here 174 should be a multiple of the options. 29, 6, 174 which means you can directly mark the option as 2.9. Moving on to the next question. Instead of solving the entire sum, just substitute a equal to b equal to c equal to 1 and verify the options. Next question. What is the total profit? Which means we have to find the ratio of ABC. Just eliminate the zeros and divide it with 25. You will get the ratio as 11 is to 13 is to 15. So the total unit is 39 which means the answer should be a multiple of 3 just verify the 3 multiple in the 4 options and uh, you will be able to solve it easily sometimes option verification might not be possible for instance look at this sum 60% of the price at the end of the second year we know that 60% means 3 by 5 so answer should be a multiple of 3 but here 2 two options satisfy the condition if you don't have much of a time then you can go for 50 50 probability or if you have time just solve it in the normal way moving on to the next question here if you take ax equal to 1 and by equal to 1 1 plus 1 2 minus 2 equal to 0 and 1 into 1 equal to 1 which means it satisfy the both conditions so you can just substitute ax equal to 1 and by equal to 1 in the final equation that is a square x plus b square y you will get answer as a plus b next question what is the b's share of profit after tax the ratio is given as 3 is to 4 is to 7 which means the final answer should be a multiple of 4 just verify the options and you will get the answer moving on to the next the value of whole property is so first we have to find the combined ratio the combined ratio is 9 is to 3 is to 1 which means total of 13 units this so the final answer should be a multiple of 13 just verify the options you will get it moving on to the next question b's gain age if you take 100 as base then the cp will be 80 and sp will be 115 which means he gains 35 units so the final answer should be a multiple of 7 just verify the options what is 27 percent of her monthly income 27 percent which means answer should be a multiple of 9 just verify 9 multiple in the options when it comes to trigonometry, instead of solving the entire sum, you can always substitute some value. For instance, here, substitute theta equal to 0. Similarly, when it comes to tan, substitute theta equal to 45. Here, just substitute a equal to 15. And when it comes to menstruation and if it involves pi then you should just check 11 multiple in most of the cases when it comes to sphere or 
सिलेंडर एक्सेट्रा इट मोस्टली वर्कस फॉर इंस्टेंस जस्ट चेक लेवन मल्टीपल इन द ऑप्शन इन दिस क्वेश्चन सो आई होप दिस आई होप यू फाउंड दिस वीडियो हेल्पफुल आई एम नॉट सेंग दैट यू कैन सॉल्व ईच एंड एवरी क्वेश्चन बाई वेरीफिकेशन बट दिस अप्रोच कैन बी यूज इन मोस्ट ऑफ द क्वेश्चन टू सेव टाइम All the best for your upcoming examination.